So I want to jump into the whole placebo effect for a little bit here and basically um, talk about the implications of that. If I give you a sugar pill and I tell you it's a sugar pill, you won't get any better. But if I tell you sugar pill and I tell you, and I, and I, and I tell you, wow, this is an amazing drug, it actually will stop your cancer, your cancer will actually stop with much higher f- probability. What does that mean? That's so amazing. That, that means way. that if I can trick your brain into thinking that I'm healing you, your brain will basically figure out a way to heal itself, to heal the body. And that tells us that there's so much that we don't understand right. in the interplay between our cognition and our biology that if we were able to better harvest the power of our brain to sort of you know, impact the body through the placebo effect, we would be so much better in so many different things. Just by tricking yourself into thinking that you're doing better, you're actually doing better. So there's something to be said about sort of positive thinking, about optimism, about sort of, you know, uh, just getting your brain and your mind into the right mindset that helps your body and helps your entire biology. Yeah, from a science perspective, that's just fascinating. I, obviously, most things about the brain is a total mystery for, for now, but that's, that's a fascinating interplay that the brain, <laughs> yeah, that the brain can reduce uh, the brain can help cure cancer is, uh, I don't even know what to do with that. I mean, the way to, to think about that is the following. The converse of the equation is something that we are much more comfortable with. Like, oh, if you're stressed, then your heart rate might rise and all kinds of sort of toxins might be released and that can have a detrimental effect in your body, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. So maybe it's easier to understand your body healing from your mind by your mind is not killing your body, <laughs> or at least it's killing it less. So I think the you know that aspect of the stress equation is a little easier for mo- most of us to conceptualize. But then the healing part is you know perhaps the same pathways, perhaps different pathways. But again, something that is totally untapped scientifically. 